With the LAP, it is also possible to draw uh, non-ceramic finds or uh, in general finds that don't have a rotational symmetry. So where we don't have a, just one main profile. For example, like this Neolithic stone X, where we would like to draw a cross, a cross section profile and the outline and uh, make a photograph. So we start with uh, capturing a detail, which will be the, the cross section. Be necessary to, to adjust the exposure, the other settings a bit. Okay, so this would be the cross section. And the next step is to switch to the outline mode or to capture the outline with the white background paper. crop envelope here you can see it's automatically outlined we can click capture we want to store this as a detail and we have the outline and you can see it's it's slightly larger because again the uh, the scale of uh, the photographs is not not exact due to the the lens properties so what I can do is uh, enable the, the grid here and move the, the, the origin point to the top here and then hold the control key and drag this handle to adjust the size. Now that it's the, the outline is the correct size, turn off the grid, and I can also take a photograph the usual way. Settings seem fine. I click capture. Have a photograph. I can also adjust this. Get holding control key. With the photographs, it's uh, not possible to, to change the, the origin point, so otherwise it, it works the same as with the profiles and details. Okay, so now we have a photograph, we have an outline, we have a cross-section. We can uh, use the, the close profile tool to close this profile here, set it to be filled. Same here, I can, uh, I can also use the smooth smoothen function here to smooth it out a bit if necessary just as i would with the ceramic finds now i might want to add some uh, uh, dimensions some measures uh, to this uh, drawing i can do this by using the the measure tool just click it move the cursor where i want the the dimension measuring to start left click the mouse hold the shift key so that the cursor moves at uh, uh, just the, the 90 degree angles and move where i want the measure to end and just left click again and now move the mouse until i'm happy where the measure is placed and i can call this length And I can add more measures similar way. So, for example, with here, left click, hold shift, again left click, and again left click. 
the dimensions are in centimeters here. So you can add the fine number and store the drawing.